welcome to this tutorial. Uh, this is the fifth um, installment on the forum tutorial which I have been posting on YouTube. In this tutorial we, we will be adding uh, subcategories and if we have time at the end we will um, use our database information to actually produce a clickable forum. Now um, you can see we've created the create forum category option which obviously does work and now we're going to create the create form subcategory. So we're going to go into our PHP designer and go to the admin page. Now we're going to uh, find what we called it. We called it create underscore subcat. Alright. Now we're going to go after this first if statement if the act is equal to that. We're going to put down a couple breaks and do if act equals create underscore subcat. Just like so. Open and closing braces. And um, now we're going to do the if post submit doesn't exist. This is written as if parentheses exclamation point post submit closing all that. In this part, we're going to echo the form. So I'm going to start off by creating a little table here. Oops, form method equals post. Post is very important in this. And like I said in the last tutorial, the action must be relevant to the action, the get action. So admin.php act equals create underscore subcat. Alright, let's go ahead and echo the first one. And this will be forum category. Alright, and now this one we're going to create a drop down list of all the current actual top categories that we've created before. So I'm going to do select name equals cat and I'm going to specify a first value. I'm going to give this a value of zero. Then I'm going to call it please choose. I'm going to close this. Now I'm just going to end that like so. And now we're going to do a query Okay, squall SQL 6. And we're just going to select star from forum underscore cats. Alright, order by ID. And we'll do ascending, which will be from greatest to least. Rest 6 equals my squall query squall 6. Or die my SQL error. Alright. Now we're going to. Um, if there's no records existing in the form category table, we'll go ahead and echo there. Oops. We're going to close the select thing. Oh. We're going to echo no categories exist. All right. Now, now we're going to go to an else statement here after the MySQL num rows. And uh, now that means at least one is oh snapple. If my okay equals zero, you gotta remember that. And now we're going to specify if row. I gotta see what I define this. Row three equals my SQL fetch asos rest six. All right. Now we're going back to our table to check our little values here. We have name, ID, and admin. We're only going to pick on um, ID and name. So we're going to echo option value equals row 3 ID. And now we're going to do our row 3 name here as the actual option which you will see when the drop down list is created. Alright, now I'm going to go ahead and end the select drop down here. And I'm going to end the table cell. Now we're going to create a new table row and cell. This will be sub cat name. This will be an input. Input type equals text. Name equals name. And the row and the cell. And now we're going to create a new table row and table cell, which will span over two rows. Or two columns, um, and we'll align it to the right and put the uh, submit button. So 
input type equals submit name equals submit value equals add forum subcategory just like so alright now we're gonna end the form in the table here we're going to uh, save it I just did now we're gonna go ahead and click create form subcategory now you'll see we have general and admin only and if we browse the table general and admin only we're gonna make some CSS adjustments here so we're gonna do content select border one pixel solid number four a seven 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 a background color number e e font color is zero 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 for black font family will be Tahoma font size is nine points we could easily simplify this put a comma after input and put select right there save it refresh it there we have it now we can select general or admin only and now we're going to get on to uh, creating the um, subcategories now let's go back into our PHP designer and go back to the admin page now after this if post submit doesn't exist we're going to add an else statement here and now um, we're going to define our main category which would be MSS post cat and our subcat we called it name is MSS post name just like so now we're going to check if cat and 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 name this means they both exist we're going to do a query to see if the category exists so select star from forum cats where ID equals cat rest 7 equals mysql query squall 7 or draw a mysql error just like so now we're gonna return if mysql numbers rest 7 equals 0 echo the forum category you supplied does not exist just like so now we'll do an else statement off that and that means it does exist now we're gonna do a, a query on the name to make sure one doesn't exist a name relating to the category as well so we're gonna go SQL 8 equals select star from forum subcats where name equals name and CID equals cat alright let's query this out SQL 8 or die my SQL error now we're going to see if uh, <coughs> the amount of rows is greater than zero. That means one it does exist. So echo the forum subcategory already exists within the main category. Easy like that. And uh, now we're going to do uh, an else statement off of that, meaning it doesn't exist. And this is where we're going to do the query. So insert into forum sub oops forum sub cats okay obviously I forgot two things I forgot the image and the description um, so actually I'm, I'm gonna remove the image and we're only gonna have a description so delete image like so we're gonna stop the flow of this query right here alright and now inside our table here, we're going to create a text area. So echo TRTD description. All right. In oops, text area name equals desk D E S C, and we're going to apply a style width 300 pixels. Height will do 60 pixels. All right end it like so we're gonna go back into our CSS and also add it onto this so text area like so admin we're going to go here refresh there you have our description box and uh, now we're going to go ahead and define a new one here desk equals MSS post desk like so and now we're gonna branch onto this and and DESC all right. 
All right, and now um. Okay, and now is what I'm going to do here. Um, let's see. Okay, and we're going to continue down here. Now we'll do um, if string length desk is greater than 255. Echo the description must be under 255 characters. Okay, else. Now we're going to do the query. I'm going to specify a new row here. So MySQL fetch associ. I'm going to link this to REST 7, and this will determine whether the form category will be administrative or not. Now we're going to do the actual query, which will insert the row. So MySQL, okay, insert into forum subcats. We have. CID for category ID, name, desk, and admin. Okay, and we're going to specify the values for those. So this one is cat. This one is name. This one is desk. And this last one is row four admin. This is linking off the um, the form sub. Oh, I have an error in here. Let's go find it. Uh, okay, let's see, where do we, oh, I have uh, one right there, okay. Now we're going to query this out, MySQL query, SQL 9, or die, MySQL. okay, error. Now we're going to go echo, the forum sub category has been, oh, comma, B, name, has been added under the main category of B row for name. End it like so, save it, we'll go to test it, refresh. Okay, we'll select general. We'll call this main chat. Main chat and this is a place for everybody to talk about anything. Okay, we'll go ahead add form subcategory. Okay, it says the form subcategory main chat has been added under the main category of general. We'll go into our PHP my admin. We'll go to our subcats. You can see there's one row. We'll go to browse. All right, we have one ID. Category ID is one, which is general. Name is main chat, description is just like this. Now we're going to go ahead and add one that is administrative only. So we'll do this, we'll call this uh, main chat. We'll actually call this, um, uh, what should we say? To do lists and admin only to do list section. Add form subcategory. Okay, we got that. We'll go ahead and browse this again to show that admin has been added with one instead of zero, hopefully. There you have it. Two, two, one, just like so. All right, um, let's check our time. We're up to 14 minutes, so I'm going to stop this video. Um, okay, well, I hope you liked this tutorial, and uh, if you did and want to see the rest of the tutorial while it branches out, Please subscribe and you will receive the videos as soon as I upload them. In our next video, we will be, we will be altering the, um, the main page of the forum. And um, we will show the forums there and we'll get on from that. Alright, well, I hope you liked this tutorial. And if you did, uh, please rate it. Um, please comment. I'll respond to your comments, whether positive or negative. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, yeah, well, um, this video will be available in high definition, if you don't already know that. Um, I've also registered the website, uh, phpsquad.net. I'm going to be redoing that sooner or later, so we're getting a nice feel to, um, the high definition videos now. 
Um, okay, well, I'll see you next time.